Hi, Life Tree Community Church. This is Bob McGurdy, and uh, your pastor, Dan, has uh, blessed me with the opportunity to just uh, share an encouraging word with you today. Um, thanks, Dan, and uh, thanks to Anna and to your church for uh, giving up your pastor for a season while uh, he was with me in Calcutta. Enjoyed the time together and, um, and just enjoyed getting to know one another. Uh, a little bit of my story, uh, my wife Twyla and I and our sons Bobby and Josiah, we uh, served as missionaries for many years, 15 in Bangladesh. We were based in the U.S. sending medical teams for about five years. And then for eight years, I was the uh, area director for India. Today and for the last two years, I have served in a lead role with Calcutta Mercy Ministries. Um, bottom line, we are involved in feeding, educating, medically assisting in Calcutta. Uh, in this coronavirus world, the big deal is that we have a 173 bed hospital right in Calcutta. And I'll talk about that at the end. When I thought of an encouraging word, when I got the voicemail, listened to it, my first thought was to talk about depression. And I know that's going to be like, wait a minute, <laughs> you got the wrong memo, encouraging word. I, I grew up with just a, I don't know, a propensity to be depressed and uh, it comes naturally in my family. And, and we're not talking about just sad and you get over it, but like binge sad for days and you you can't even say why I'm sad. And, uh, and when I came to faith as a teenager in the Air Force, um, I happened on the book of Philippians. And I'm going to read Philippians 4, and I'm just going to read verses 8 and 9. Uh, Finally, brothers and sisters, whatever's true, whatever's noble, whatever's right, whatever's pure, whatever's lovely, whatever is admirable, if anything is excellent or praiseworthy, Think about such things. Whatever you have learned or received from me, put into practice and the God of peace will be with you. Now, I just need to say this is Max, uh, brand new in the family and uh, hadn't gotten over the rules yet or hasn't fully taught him to us. So Philippians 4, um, to me, if I'm in a funk, I just read that. Whatever's good, Whatever's right, whatever's honest, whatever's pure, think about that. And it is like an instant formula to get out of depression. And so if you're struggling, you're sad, whatever's good, what, what's good, what's right, what's pure, think on those things. And, and I really think it will help you. And uh, maybe you're not prone to sadness like I am. Maybe we're in a season of it. Uh, so, so think on the good things and, uh, and, and happiness comes. I really believe that. And it, it's a scriptural formula. Whatever's true, right, noble, pure, lovely, admirable. If there's anything excellent or praiseworthy, and there's many things, think about those things. And, and it just, it just works. Um, real quick, our, we have a hospital in Calcutta. Uh, do pray. We're, we're trying to raise funds. We're trying to do things. Our big thing is to make sure we have protective gear. Um, India could face uh, coronavirus in a major, major way, and we're doing all we can to help our workers. So thanks again, and thank you, Dan. And uh, this is Bob and Max, and uh, God bless you.